All right, welcome back in here just after 5 a.m. on your first day of March. Yes, you're able to kind of cross out those first two months of the year. We're officially here in the meteorological spring. And as I've been saying this morning, it's going to feel a little bit like spring for some of us. Parts of the area maybe reaching as warm as the low 60s today. You'll see that in my hour by hour forecast. Also, we've got some showers showing up. Most of this has been very light. I don't think it's going to hang around for very long at all. <clears throat> and probably by the time we get to about 530, most of this is 6, 536 o'clock somewhere there. Most of this is completely out of the area. So we're going to call the forecast dry today once we get past the next hour or so right now. 39 in Toledo, 41 in Columbus, a little bit more mild off to the south and some breezy weather is going to bring in this warmer air today, eventually allowing for those high temperatures to get up as we were just talking about in some parts of the area up into the 60s. Right now, here's a live look from our Levis Commons camera. Yeah, it might be sprinkling in a few spots, but it doesn't seem to be doing a whole lot out there. The biggest thing we're going to watch out for here, just maybe a reminder as we go into the month of March, of course, our daylight continues to expand. Perhaps you've noticed this with those sunny skies we had yesterday afternoon. We're gaining about two and three quarters minute every single day here when it comes to daylight and our sunset tonight isn't until 624 in the evening. Of course, daylight saving time is right around the corner and that's going to push that sunset time back even further. Our hour by hour forecast here. Let's get to it showing you by noon. The 50s starting to move in and by later on this afternoon, Tiffin, Upper Sandusky, Finley over towards Putnam County. Yeah, I see you guys even Fremont maybe touching on 60 degrees today. 57 for a high temperature in Toledo, a little bit cooler near the lake shore. Tomorrow looks quiet and cooler with highs will all slide back down into the 40s. We're still tracking this system on Friday. Promises to bring heavy rainfall back to the area. Saturday and Sunday are looking dry and then more light showers Monday, Tuesday, a very spring like pattern. That's going to keep those ditches, rivers and creeks pretty swollen for the next couple of days.